श्री त्रिचू शिवाज थैंक यू डेप्टी चेयरमैन सर सर चेंजिंग सिचुएशन वॉरंट चेंज इन अप्रू अप्रोच फॉर रिसॉल्विंग इश्यूज सर द चेंज इन द इकोनॉमिक एक्टिविटी डिमांड्स एक्सपीडियस सेटलमेंट ऑफ द डिस्प्यूट्स एंड ऑफकोर्स द रेजोल्यूशन ऑफ डिस्प्यूट्स ऑफकोर्स एज ए वेरी ह्यूज इम्पैक्ट ऑन द इकोनॉमी ऑफ द कंट्री एज वेल एज डूइंग बिजनेस सर सो एन आल्टरनेटिव मैकेनिज्म is required and when litigants resort to the judicial process of an adjudication for their litig litigations it is always one side winning another side losing but in the process of arbitration it is a win win situation so for this arbitration our litigants have to go to singapore hong kong london and all so i think the government's initiative to constitute an arbitration center in india is to be welcomed sir sir uh, for this a committee was appointed sri krishna committee and everyone has mentioned that that committee has given some recommendations and someone asked why it has not been accepted total any committee's recommendations cannot be accepted total sir but whichever is necessary if they are accepted it should be welcome one among the recommendations is that uh, the international center for alternative dispute resolution which was set up in the year 1995 with the government funds to promote alternative dispute resolution mechanism as however not been able to achieve so the committee recommended that the international center for alternative dispute resolution should be taken over with complete revamp of its governance structure to include only experts of repute who can lend credibility and respectability to the institution and be rebranded as a center of national importance to highlight a char in character as a flagship arbitral institution sir uh, why it is uh, minister in his introductory remarks told that government has given 30 crore rupees and 700 members were there and the uh, uh, settled litigations were only within 100 or so and they were indulging in other activities so it was considered to be a sixth finger so i think the recommendations of the committee has been taken rightly and it is being taken uh, taken over but how it is taken over was a question raised by the learned uh, uh, senior colleague mr chidambaram and abhishek singh and when it is taken over the constitution of the new council the chairman and the eminent persons who are all appointed or by the central government so the suspicion or the doubt comes when the litigant becomes the government what will be the mindset of the other person so that question arises and i think minister has to assuage the apprehension whichever may arise in the minds of not the members sir but in the minds of the litigants sir this question was repeatedly told here and uh, of course we have to accept that caesar's wife must be above suspicion when a person is approaching a court of law or an arbitral arbitral center for his resolution of disputes when he has a doubt that this won't give him the desired result i think that has to be uh, addressed by the the government sir or the, by the minister when he says so i, I think uh, uh, this is the main situation and uh, of course the other bill uh, the amendment bill sir and about the constitution i about that also everyone has mentioned about so i think nothing much need to be told sir of course we need this international center as ashwini mr ashwini point my, my colleague pointed out uh, in due course of time when there will be more need for arbitration as uh, in the initial outset i told that economic activity increases we need we will be in, uh, in need of more centers will that be then also called as new delhi uh, arbitration center that is a big question sir why can't it be called as an indian arbitration center can have more than one more than one when it comes uh, because we have one supreme court and we are asking for a bench of the supreme court in the south india in chennai and all because litigants have, uh, have to come all the way so also in future some sub centers of course have to be created and what will it be named as it's a it's also a small question chennai. sir chennai Uh, Mumbai or wherever the litigations are more, sir, 
what will be your name? So I think it could be the nomenclature could have been something Indian. <laughs> Uh, uh, name that also. This is one, one of our recommendations, that's all. Suggestions or other. So, uh, with these words, sir, I, I, I support this bill and welcome this bill, but for this is very much necessary at this point of time for doing uh, business very easily in this country and to adjust with the developing economic activity. Thank, Thank you, Tiruchuri. <coughs>